Hey, it's Tom from WPWithTom.com, and in this video, I'll be covering an awesome lifetime deal on a Google Keyword Rank Tracker. All right, so to dive right in here, this tool is called SerpWatch, and if you use my link below, WPWithTom.com slash SerpWatch, it should get you 10% off if it's your first order on AppSumo. And if you just want to support my channel and use it, I greatly appreciate it. But this will take you to this AppSumo page where you can learn more about it and ask questions before purchasing it if you want. But you can see right here it says $59 for the lifetime deal. And if you go down here, they actually even have a video on it where they cover some of the things that I'm also going to talk about here as well as some details about it. And if we scroll down here, you can see everything that's included in all of these plans and features. And then you can actually order more codes if you want to have more access and track even more keywords. So there's lots of different options with this tool. You can get started for $59 to track 150 keywords, and that's great if you have just one website. If you're anything like me and you have a bunch of different websites, you're gonna probably wanna stack more than just one code. I actually ended up stacking four codes to track 1,000 keywords in total on my plan that I have. So the two main reasons I'm showing you this tool are because one, it's a lifetime deal, and two, because I think you can really benefit from it, especially if you have a lot of clients or websites that you want to track. So if you're not familiar with AppSumo, I have a review on it, but there's also some other pretty cool tools on here, like a lifetime deal on ShortPixel, which I've also picked up before, and I think I've discussed that on my channel here before. If not, ShortPixel is a great tool, and there's lots of other tools on here that you might be interested in. But for now, let's just dive into SerpWatch over here. So if you go to their website, serpwatch.io, you can actually go through a live demo process. Now, I don't think you're going to be able to get that deal like you're going to get through my AppSumo link here for $59 for lifetime access. But you can go and check it out with a live demo for yourself and test the features here. So I'm going to use this instead of my actual account with all my different websites. I'd rather keep those websites private, but here you can see that there's different examples and you can see how many keywords are being tracked, if they're going up and down, what the changes are, the location for the area it's being tracked. So if you want to, you can track for USA, you can track for Canada, England, wherever you want to track and whichever search engine you want to use. So if you want to track Bing in particular instead of Google, you could do that. But I personally like to track Google.com since I'm in the U.S. and a lot of my customers are in the U.S. and it's in English. So it just makes, makes sense for me to do English and Google.com. So if I went down here and I went to this demo project right here and I just clicked on it, this will give us an example of some of the features once you actually get into this. So you would upload a new project. It's just a matter of a few clicks and typing in your website name. And then you would select different features. So google.com, you put in your domain name, the area and the language right here. And then you can put in the keywords that you want tracked. So you can actually upload a CSV file or you can go and manually put them in one by one. If you don't have a lot, it's probably fine. Eight keywords, it's not very hard. You would just enter it, comma, enter it, comma, and then you'll have your list and you'll enter it in once you're set and then it will start tracking them. It's really easy to delete ones out if you want as well. You can choose how often it's updated. Now, I personally like to do updated daily. You actually have the option to update it hourly, every two hours, every six hours, or 12 hours. I recommend doing it daily. In this case, I think you could start going a little crazy if you update it too often, especially when you get emailed reports to you, which is another option they have here. So you can also see what the project monthly value is considered to be. This could be something good if you're showing it to clients and there is actually a white label option for this platform for clients as well. So that can really come in handy if you have an agency or something like that. And then if we were to go down here, you actually have other options. So if you hover over this, it says that there was most likely a Google update during these times and it gives you notifications of that. So that could be helpful if you have a client as well and they wanna see why this position go down a couple spots or up a couple spots, you can see that there was a Google update those days. And if we were to scroll down from here, we can go down and see different keywords. So on this mock website right here, let's just go and click on a random one. Let's just go best yard vacuum right here. And I'll click on that. And then it will open up this new tab with the article itself. So it finds the article best yard vacuum right here. And then if you want to, you can go and actually click on the 
different search topic. I actually clicked the wrong one, but this is best eyebrow tinting kit. So if we're in here and you want it to hover over, you can see it says open screenshot once you're in the actual keyword. So it says we're position seven. If we go and click open screenshot, it will open a screenshot and we'll show this website. So this is 16best.net. If we scroll down a little bit, we can see right here, 16best.net. It's not the most clean screenshot, but you can see right there, there it says best eyebrow tinting kit reviews and it's the article that's associated with our site and 16best.net. So you literally can have screenshot proof that that is where it's ranking within Google. And that's a pretty cool feature, I feel like. And I think that's something that your clients would love to see from time to time. You also have options to check different SERP features. So if we click on that, you can see that there's different options right here. There's so many different things. Google reviews, people ask, knowledge graph, answer box, video, paid, featured snippet, and images. You can look at the revenue as well over here. There's not going to be a lot to show in this example. There's also an analytics tab as well, where you can get analytics on how many users are going to the site. And again, you can add notes right here as well. I should have covered that before. And you can see when there was Google updates. And here you can actually look at competitors as well, which is a pretty cool feature. And I really like that they built this in. So there's a lot of features jam packed into this. In reality, I just got this tool yesterday and I'm loving it so far, but there's a lot for me to learn but I'm just wanting to bring this one to your attention because I think it's a tool that could really be worth taking advantage of with the lifetime access to it over here on AppSumo. So if you want to just check it out through my link below, wpwithtom.com slash SERPwatch. And I highly recommend you check it out for yourself. And with AppSumo, you always have a money back guarantee. If you don't like it, you can get a refund. So really there's no risk involved here. So I hope you enjoyed this video about this SERPwatch tool. If you did, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribe for more WordPress related content. Thanks for viewing and have a wonderful day.